Okay, so here's an easy way to make a spider shock mount for your Austin ribbon microphone. First thing you need is a cheap uh, microphone mount. These are two or three bucks. The second thing you need is a, uh, a hose clamp that's uh, about one and three quarters inches, expands to one and three quarter inches. The third thing you need is a piece of ABS plastic pipe. This one's three inches uh, and it's uh, made of ABS plastic. You can get that at a hardware store. And then the secret ingredient is hair ties. Uh, these are the ones that have no metal clips on the back. They're all, uh, all felt or all uh, fabric. So let's do this in real time to see how easy it really is. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my microphone clip oops, and I'm going to unscrew it so that uh, I can take out the clip because we don't need this clip part at all. We don't need that. So we'll put that off to the side. So we just have that. And we have this, and we'll just put this in here right there for right now. And then while I'm at it here with the screwdriver, I'll unscrew this hose clamp all the way so that you can, you can uh, break it open like this, okay? So now the hose clamp's undone. I'm also going to take my hair ties, which I've just purchased, and I'm going to slip off, let's do four of them, I'm going to do four of them, okay? And I'm going to put those in the uh, hose clamp right there. Let me take off this piece of paper here too, so that we're done there, okay? Then I'm going to reconnect the hose clamp, and then I'm going to... Uh, just tighten it down a little bit right now. So now I have four um, of these hair ties surrounding uh, that are in the hose clamp. <clears throat> the next thing you need to do is cut a slice down the inside of the ABS plastic pipe. Let me see if I can move this camera so you can see it a little bit better. All right. And I'm going to use a coping saw just to cut a slice down the center of this pipe. Okay, so now I've got a hole, basically, in the, in the ABS pipe. Okay, so let me just sort of deburr these edges with my fingers on the inside. Okay, good enough. Now what you do is you take your four uh, hair, hair ties right here. I'm going to slide each of them in here, one by one if you like. Let's see. This is harder than it looks. Go like this. We'll slide one of them in here like this. One. Oops, wait, you got to have this on the inside, don't we? So we'll put that on the inside. And then we'll have two. And then we'll have three. So what you're doing is that you now have the hair ties going around the outside of the, uh-oh, this one's twisted. How did that happen? Well, live video is what it is. This one is twisted, so I'm gonna put this one back to, get this one in here too. You get the idea. You pull these through and so that the, the ties go around the outside. And then you can spread them out here. Um, since I have four of them, I'm going to do them on uh, 90 degree patterns. And there I have basically what amounts to a spider mount for my microphone. If I take my microphone and put it in here, um, I'm going to need to tighten down on that, uh, that hose clamp, but I can't because I can't get to it through the side of the, the uh, ABS plastic. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my drill and I'm going to drill a hole so that I can get to it. And I'm just going to do it like this, right in the side. I'm using a step drill, but you can use any drill that you want, so that you can get a uh, 
Nice hole on the side here. Hold on. So that I can reach my screwdriver in there. I need a different drill. I'm getting a drill from over here. The idea is that you have enough uh, of a hole to get your screwdriver through there. I don't know if you can quite see that. And uh, tighten down that, that clamp. So, let's see. What else do we want to do? I think that's it. Oh, we need to make a, uh, we need to make the mount for this. So, again, using um, this, this happens to fit right on there. I'm going to put it right below that hole. I'm going to drill a hole, mark it a little bit. I'm going to drill a hole right there. You obviously don't want to do this with any microphone caught in there. Uh-oh, I need to tighten this down. And here's where I can use my step drill because this piece has to be able to fit through there. So I can use my step drill. Open that up a little bit. Now that piece should fit through there. All right, let me clean up my space here. Now I can put this on here like this. That, oops, I'm gonna have to just, I'm just eyeballing this. If you wanted to do this for real, I'm gonna have to do this slightly lower. There we go. Then I can actually do that from the other side. This one is one-sided. Some of them are uh, two-sided. There we go. I can put that in there, and I don't have a screwdriver, so I'm just gonna use my little bit here. All right, so I now have a spider suspended clip that I can reach with my screwdriver through this hole um, and I can uh, mount a microphone in there. Pretty simple. If you want to go to the next level, you can cut out these pieces. I've just taken this and then cut out some square pieces and I have a, a spider mount that actually looks kind of like a spider mount. I don't think it really makes any difference. This took me an hour to do. This took me five minutes to do and it's basically the same thing. The only issue is that, is that if you have a microphone where you have the address, side address pattern right here, you'd want to uh, cut those out. But usually you can just move this up. If you really want to be creative, you could put two of these uh, hose clamps in there so that you have two of them clamping it. Uh, otherwise, that's it.